<laughs> this, this specific moment in time. Bunch of old men beating up young kids at a video game. I know. And feeling proud about it. If you think I'm not going to go home and brag to my girlfriend, I'm gonna. <laughs> no, no worries. I'll be like, Colin, please pay the rent. <laughs> I'll be like, oh, can't, babe. Can't. Too old, too old, can't today. So Croy is sticking with the waffle? I, li I like it. Um, I, I think from the first set that we saw, um, it's a good fit of a character. Um, it gets him out of the <laughs> low tier zone. <laughs> or the low or mid tier zone, or whatever you find his normal character. Why did that trip? Um, I didn't know that could trip. I'll tell you this. It's a Greninja thing, and I don't care for it. Kind of just trading single hits right now. Yeah. You're not going to be getting anything huge started. And Wolf is, fortunately for him, past that danger zone where you can just get gimped. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe the car. Let's go. Nice. Air I'm getting hit by whatever that was every day of the week. Nice. Uh, yep, yeah, that's true at that percent. So, probably the, uh, the worst feeling about playing a against a character like Greninja when you're with a character that you're not 100% comfortable with, yeah, with is that hitting the character and just sort of like the little details really kind of get bigger. Yep. Because it's... You have to space so precise against Greninja because he's so damn low profile. Yeah. I cannot believe that hit. Yeah. Like low profile, the speed, um, always hitting the buttons so if you don't know your frame data, you're getting hit by stuff. Yeah. Um, but so far doing a good job. I mean, you're just going to take this damage early on. Um, okay. Double fair. Oh, what the hell? That was wonky. Nice. I like Nair to fix this stuff. That's going to be rough. Um. So I think, uh, regardless of how the set is, uh, this is going to be interesting to see for sticks and bolt how these sets are going to look in like the coming weeks. Uh, for now. Just because I know how it feels when you have all the ideas in play. But just like getting comfortable with the character, especially against someone who's good as strong. Um, nice parry. Yeah, it's gonna kill. Oh wow, not quite. He's the he's the biggest boy. Oh, I I respect it. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Rare footage of Wolf Jab. <laughs> wolf Jab Brad. Easily Wolf's worst move. Which is not to say it's terrible, it's just very low reward compared to everything else Wolf does. Well, yeah. Okay. Yeah, some characters would kill for that. Yeah. <laughs> nice spacing on that. Space out the dash attack. And that's gonna do it. <laughs> Aaron banning the stages on which his up smash does not work. I mean, listen, good counter picks are good counter, or good bans when it comes to counter picks are good. Oh, we got the speed. Oh, oh, he says, you know what? Fuck that. Why would I try to hit the precise wolf moves when I can just start mining? I don't know if I've seen that fight Aaron with Speed yet. Yeah, I'm a, this is also, this is, as far as I'm concerned, Corey might just be doing this for some, get the data. True. Uh, I do think, I think there is something to putting up obstacles that makes it so like, obviously he dash attacks through that, but, because uh, Aaron loves to go through the loves to hit the, the dash attack, try to get the confirms going. Uh, it's 1-0 for Aaron right now. Yeah. Against a character as fast as Greninja, though, he really doesn't have a lot of time to mine unless yeah. he's uh, actually securing the wins and getting a chance. Yeah. Best okay. case scenario is that this deficit is just how the first stock goes. All the counter picks. He's got some decent percent there, but he's still using the base sword. <laughs> okay, build better one. 
That's it. Got himself a stone one, I think. It's using like the fucking broken sword hilt from Dark Souls. I was like, oh cool, that has no ring. It does no damage. So Gronk takes the first stock, but there's diamond in the bank. Diamond in the bank. Card. And oh, he just exploded. <laughs> if you're Corey, you're thinking, okay, I'll take that first stock kind of beat up. Because yeah. now I get to I get to have a lot of fun. Yeah, that's the uh, the annoying part about Steve is the first stock lead is not a lead. Yeah, that's it. Because it's he's gonna have diamond. If, if you lose that first stock, it's like oh something terribly wrong is happening. Ooh. Oh, nice. The explosion hiding the minecart. Not the best trade for Gronk there. No. Okay. Do we have a, a, This is definitely going better. I mean, we have to remember that um, Corey's put more work into Steve than he has worked so far. Absolutely. But he's definitely. Uh, I think he, he kind of knows what tools to use to make this look a little more uncomfortable. Uh, and, you know, when you have diamonds. Good edge guard. Anything can happen. And he says, you know what? Fuck it. Check this out. Back it. Grok committing a little harder to finish that one off. Yeah, he easy said, no, I'm just going to back up. Yeah. You, uh. Wait, I don't know what funny YouTube clip you're going for. That's it. I'm not going to be on the. The, the Croy SSB Twitter highlight. I'm not gonna get hit by one of those. Uh, nice. Back oh. hit, down smash. Got another diamond in the back. Oh, he's, bah. he might just be dead. Yeah. <laughs> bah. That percent. Okay, so we got the diamond back out again on even stocks. Oh my god. Did you think you were gonna get to play the video again? Nice. Stack <laughs> him Percents are pretty close, but the kill power differential, unless Greninja hits <laughs> hits the down tilt up smash, oh, nice. the kill percent is definitely expected to be Steve earlier. Uh, Steve getting the kill earlier, I should say. Ooh. Uh. The low profile gain underneath that dirt ball. Running low on resources now. Nice double jump by by Cora there. Oh, nice off pieces. Oh! I cannot believe he had the balls to parry up smash on a platform. That's that's my that's my elite smash legend right there going for that parry. Oh yep, find himself a little bit more resources. There we go, there we go. Oh rack him up. Nice. Yeah, not <laughs> not in worry of the kill throw yet. Shouldn't be able to follow up on that. Yeah, too far. Oh, he broke it. That's wrong. Oh, he just rips it. That was amazing. He faked out the mine. He, it's, he broke the pickaxe, so he still had the sword. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he faked the mining and then immediately ripped the F smash. That was actually that pretty was big super, brain. That was super cool. I'm telling you right now, I get hit by that forward smash. There's no window where I was going to hang back and not get hit by that forward smash. Or <laughs> There's no timeline. It's 1-1 it's one, one in, in every set. Doctor Strange has seen a thousand universes, and in every single one of them, you got hit by that forward oh, smash. Oh, of course, yeah. Yeah. That's it. Even if I took game one, it's one one. Brian and I are one one. It's 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 fine. I'm, I'm over it. I'm over it. The question is, is Gronk over here? As we head into you. So, game three. I like it. We're gonna take it right back here. I know he likes it. Obviously, sticking with the Spiven. It's a one in the first game. Or, uh, well, you know what I mean. Yeah. This is what it is. Really solid play right now. Oh no. Yeah, this this early part of the game is tough for Steve because he can't put up uh he can't put up the more durable walls until he actually has decent materials. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure Greninja can clear through the uh, the frig, uh, the the clay blocks in like one down tilt or something like that, where the other one's taking more. Right. Uh, and obviously, when you're dealing with larger walls of blocks, you, if you destroy the bottom one, you can just run underneath them. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so being able to break that in one D tilt instead of two or three is a big deal. Yeah, it just feels like any any walls right now. 
Um, it does feel like he's, he's really well and not really good. And low profiling over anything that's on like the second level. It's just pretty. Uh, that's a helpful tool to have in this matchup. Collects some nice early damage on that uh, up smash. Yeah. So we know that once he gets the diamond, gets some resources, the match starts to change quite a bit. Yeah. So like how much you can build in the early part of the match is really important. I, mean, I think he's doing better this time than in the last one. Gronk or Croy? Gronk was doing better. Yeah, so yeah. In, ter in terms of uh, kind of not letting the diamond Ooh. come in. I think last match they got a diamond, he killed him with a back air, which even stopped. Yeah. On the second one. That Whereas this time, kill, yeah. That might. Yeah, this time a much more commanding lead, um, and it's going to take a little bit more magic for Core for to get back in the middle. Oh, he doesn't have the iron! He didn't have the iron for the down throw! Rare footage of Steve actually being limited by his resource. Okay. You, you uh, know, you know, the bread and butter? Yeah, the Gronk classic. Got a nice chunk of resources there since he was just out of range of the uh, water shurikens. Oh, Ooh. that would have been big, but it would was still a wooden sword, I think, so <laughs> wouldn't have killed him. Get him with a Kokiri sword or whatever from Ocarina of Time. Oh, that's kill. Yeah. Yeah, I think what's what's really cool about because Grog is a long time veteran of the team. Yeah. Usually a lot of him. This character allows him to kind of channel all of his best qualities in a way where it's like he lost the previous game and then he just was able to sort of buckle down and just do the things that he wants to do. Yeah. Uh, so like that is like the most of his ability. Um, so he can play his great neutral game but he also gets rewarded substantially with the punish game. Um, he's able to be aggressive, he can go off stage, good recovery. I like, I actually like that he's yeah, that game was decidedly less close, and Gronk had control of the momentum, so I agree with this. Corey's saying, you know what? No, I want to I wanna run into the Raz and win the finals. Because I want Raz to taste the world. <laughs> taste the double. Sorry, that's the Raz. Oh, I was <laughs> <laughs> looking for the neutral get up for the roll there. Yeah, I think I got the This is devastating for our stocks right now. Nice catch. So, with Corey and the Banjo, we know that we've seen this is the most polished character. Ooh. Uh, it's a good thing that didn't hit like more knockback, because that would have been devastating. <laughs> Nice grenade. Roy has one feather left in the tank on this stock, I think. I find barring SDs, he's always able to use them pretty well and like get them all out. Which is yeah. Nice. Yep. Yeah. That's cool. That's what's gonna happen. Good to buy a down All right. On to the next. Nice. They did have the down tilt and land with the nair. So we were seeing with Wolf, um, where he was very good at getting sort of landing nairs in the ground and other balls. It's going to be like that times a thousand when he's using the handle. Yeah, the, the drag downs are very, very difficult to work around for sure. Yeah, and not to mention he's just because he's so comfortable with the character, if he hits it, the efficiency is going to be through the roof. Yeah. Oh, that, yeah, almost killed, but not quite. Oh, nice up tilt. Wild. Just kind of snuck under there like he was throwing at a snake up tilt. Yeah. This could be the next character that Corey picks up in the least match. <laughs> He's going to use the snake. He's been expired. Ooh, yeah, attacking on some substantial extra damage there. 
when you end up a stock behind Croy's Banjo like this, it's really frustrating. Yeah. Because the, the incidental damage adds up really fast. Oh my god! You gotta, you gotta respect that this guy's crazy. I mean, that, that, I think, that encounter were the only options that caused him to not die there. Yeah. <laughs> like, I thought for sure he was dead. We're going to game five. I got hit by every every time that Gronk got hit by a side B, I got hit by one too. Yep. They were so well. I was almost like gonna speak up and they got a band how bash it was just wildly efficient. Just it's too similar to stages. Um Sorry, are they were so so good at getting that little bits of extra damage, knowing exactly where to place what to be throwing a, you know, shooting an egg at someone, throwing a grenade, getting an aerial, going for a grab, just doing anything. He just knows what's going to get the hit here. Do it. Get out. And it's also very impressive because there's someone like Greninja who moves so much. I respect this choice. I think FD is pretty good. Kind of narrow down where the interactions can be. Well, it, it gives Greninja so much room to use his vertical jump. Yeah. Um, and there's no platforms to obstruct him landing in on you with a forward air. Yeah. And then all the yeah all the conversions from uh, down tilt are just gonna kind of like flow nicely into each other. Playing very good. Right now. Nice conversion <laughs> off the egg. Gets himself a little more damage because Gronk was mashing. Yeah, yeah. And suddenly it's even. That was great. That was. Something that led into a forward air, and now he has the stock after some really well placed moves. Yeah, Gronk's, uh, Gronk's hitting hot pressing buttons at a hit stun a little bit. It's gotten him hit by two of those Wonder Wings. Okay, that shouldn't kill. Yeah, not quite. Banjo a heavy boy. Oh, I like the counter idea there. Mm -hmm. Thanks jumping around the grenade. I think, it, I do think he's gonna, yeah, he's gonna want to try to slow down a little bit. Um, like you said, try not to get hit caught hitting buttons. Nice there you go. There you go. I like I like how we uh moved out of the way. There you go. Taking some simple damage with the up smashes. He's definitely he's playing more grounded and uh, a little bit more in control of the kind of when he's swinging at. Oh my goodness. Surprised that grab, but... I'm not, because it's the one good thing about Greninja's grab. Yeah. But he uh, finds himself duffed. I also got hit by That's such an annoying combo to get hit by. <laughs> Drag down there and jab. So you get all the same sound effects? Yeah. Like, come on. Sounds like someone's drilling in my apartment. So we're in that same situation with uh, Croy sitting on a stock lead. Yeah. Gronk's trying to slow it down to his credit. Oh, but... And that's also another... When you get caught mashing, I mean, it, it was kind of projected what you were going to do. They were both mashing. Right? Oh, yep. This is a rough spot now. Oh! Uh, he just really well placed her. Oh, no! Yeah, this is, this is pulling away from... Him. He's got to play basically perfect to, uh... That's unfortunate. I don't think he meant to do that. Probably not. I'm guessing it's supposed to be a grenade. It's looking like this is going to go to Croy. Yep. Nice and that'll do it. Croy takes it 3-2. to two. Banjo getting it done. It's not that it's... It's... 